Mackenzie Pasich here inside the Prudential Center, joined by Matt Frivola after, quite frankly, steamrolling his way through Drew Dober. Matt, how are you feeling after that performance? I feel amazing. There's no better feeling when the hard work pays off. You said you were going to be the first to knock out Drew Dober inside the octagon, and the confidence that was radiating from you, like, made us all believe it. So it was a little surreal to see it happen. Walk us through the finish, though. Um, you know, I was I was in there and I was relying on my my instincts of training through my you know hard work and my years of training and uh, you know this this right hand you know the old f bomb this is what I've relied on a lot back in the day and uh, you know I'm pretty I I ducked and I threw it and it landed and he fell you know. <laughs> And then, of course, some follow-up shots when you have to keep going to get the finish, of course, until the official steps in. What's going through your mind in those moments? It's uh, finished. Keep going. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Uh, keep keep hammering. And, um, you know, I had one fight against Valdez where I kept dropping him, and, and he kept getting back up, and he kept dropping him. He kept getting back up. Uh, so I was like getting, I almost, like every time I drop somebody now, I'm like, I just keep going and I'm like, let's go, like get the finish, 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 finish. And, you know, we got the finish this time. So it's good. A lot of emotion coming from you after the fight finished. It's an obvious question, but what, what was the source of that emotion? I'm, I'm just truly blessed and I thank God, you know, thank God, because that could, that could be me at the highest level. Anybody could beat anybody. Uh, it's who shows up. It's who lands. And I've been in that case, you know, and I've gotten finished like that. Um, but just these last couple fights, you know, I've I've been the finisher. And and on my best day, I can I can finish anybody. And I truly believe that. And uh, you know, my my chances have been great. Of course, you're now unbeaten three in the tri-state area. I got to say tri-state because the other two were in New York, but kind of a home crowd for you. How did it feel to be out in an arena kind of in your backyard? It felt great. You know, we're, we're not too far away, just in Jersey. Uh, I love the Prudential Center was, was going wild. Uh, the walkout was great. I felt the energy and I fed off the energy and, and it was amazing. Of course, the call out of Patty Pimblett. Why is that the fight that makes sense for you to have next? It, because he's on a four fight win streak and he's got to fight somebody. He's got to fight somebody good. You know, in the UFC, you don't pick and choose your fights. You fight the best. And uh, he's on a four fight win streak. He's got to fight somebody good. And that's me. Well, that's an incredible fight that we can't wait to see whether it happens next or down the road. Congratulations. We'll let you get back to your team.